Hey friends, Jeff here from Bygone and beautiful Maisomania, Wisconsin, here with our Frame Off Restored 1946 Chevy pickup truck. Going to do a cold start on the truck uh, this afternoon and just wanted to go through that process a little bit. Uh, it is an old vehicle, so we have a manual choke and uh, there is a throttle cable as well. This throttle cable is not connected, and so what that would do is as you'd pull this out, uh, it would tug on the throttle uh, control on the carburetor and basically, uh, you know, give the vehicle some gas as it's warming up. Um, that isn't working, so unfortunately, during that warm-up process, you do need to uh, stay in the vehicle and just give it a little bit of gas. Um which isn't a big deal in summer, uh, and I don't think too many folks are going to be driving this truck in the dead of winter, so I, I think it'll be all right, but it's a piece of cake to reconnect if you choose to. Say, uh, go ahead and we're gonna turn the key in the on position. You'll see that the fuel gauge uh, moves up, we have power, and then off to the right of the uh, gas pedal, you got that starter solenoid. It's, uh, you know, that old saying, go ahead and push the starter, so, that, uh, that, my friends, is not something that we're used to seeing anymore. Uh, but let's go ahead and uh, let's, uh, let's see, see how she goes here. And then it's just a combination of, you know, I've got my foot on the, on the gas here. And I've got that choke about midway. It's about yeah, 45, 50 degrees in my shop. So we'll go ahead and we'll uh, we'll let it warm up, and you can just hear it idle. Okay. Talk to you soon. All right, friends. I'd say it's been just a a minute or so. I did back the truck out, uh, but you can see. The choke is in, foot off the gas, but you can you can see, I mean, it's only, it's literally only been about two minutes. So we're going to uh, jockey the truck around here a little bit. So we'll go ahead and uh, continue to let it warm up and get it parked back in the, the shop where it needs to be. But if you do have any questions at all, feel free to reach out. Those of you who have worked with us before know that uh, we enjoy talking about the vehicles that we have for sale and uh, really love to find a, a loving new caretaker for this 46 Chevy. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.